Hello there guys and welcome to the next episode of this Blackpool gameplay. Um, I've played a few games since we've last uh, been on this, and only two games by the way. Uh, the first one was a defeat to Cardiff, but the second one was actually a really decisive win against Wickham in the FA Cup. Uh, Madeira got two, Richie Wellens got one, Fenton got the other one. So we've been doing really well at the moment in that aspect of things. So um, yeah, not too bad at all. So Fenton obviously came on off the bench for Madeira and he managed to get that goal. Uh, but that means that we've set up a home tie against Carlisle. Carlisle are ninth in Division 3, which means that we are favourites to actually beat these in the next round. And then ultimately after that, we're hoping to get a Premier League team in the next round. Or even better, get a lower league team again and keep progressing as we go on. After that, we've got the Vans Trophy against Southport. Another game that we could win. And then a nice home game against Notts County. Um, so yeah, it's going to be quite a busy period. There's quite a few home games coming up. But... We actually stand a chance in all of these games. There's no reason why we can't go all out and actually batter every team that we face. <clears throat> so we'll have a little look now. We'll see how we get on with this. So, financial trouble, Everton again. Oh, they're bankrupt. Woo. Yeah, they're really struggling, aren't they, actually? I didn't actually... I wonder value. Let's have a look at value. I mean, how much money? We don't have a lot of money to spend. We've got seventy-five k. But I'm just looking at a few of these players that may possibly want to move on. <clears throat> Obviously, they're going to be younger players. He's not a bad one, let alone. Nah, I don't know. For sixty-five k, I'm not too sure if I want any one of those. To be well, we could go for Leon Osman, Margate. These contracts up in 02. I'm going to add him to my shortlist, you know. Anyway, let's move on. We've got Stoke at home next. Uh, team looks okay at the moment. Um, obviously, we've still got Hills out. We've got Strachan out. We've got Milligan out. Milligan isn't really a first team player. Strachan is. Uh, Hills is as well. But yeah, we'll see how we get on here. Hopefully, we can get the three points to, to root us up this table a bit further. Um, but we'll see. And there we go. Stoke lead 1 0 already. <clears throat> So it really is now. I mean, Stoke aren't the team that obviously they were a few years ahead of their time, but we've still got to try and push on here. If we want to go up, these are the games we've got to win. <clears throat> Goodness me, every time I seem to do a commentary, I seem to have a bad throat as well. I don't know why. Let's go get myself a drink of water or something. Have the next one. Okay, right. It's still... Yeah, and the thing is, the attendance as well. I think we asked about the stadium being increased. I'm sure they said no, but I might actually ask them after this game if it ca if it could possibly be considered to um, to get bigger. Because six, if, if we're filling it up in just six thousand, that's two nil, man. I'm surprised. Where are Stoke? Like mid table. I mean, yeah, we really should be doing better than what we're doing here. Ian Hughes playing at five. It's not good enough. That wasn't good enough at all. I'm going to actually ask them now, board request, to expand the stadium. They don't believe... Okay. <clears throat> I actually do think it does need expansion, to be honest with you. I can understand if it's any money issues that are going on at the club. But we'll just have to wait and see. I mean, hopefully this next game will help with the financial state of things, uh, winning this FA Cup game, but... We've got to win it first, haven't we? Here we go. Are these contracts out as well? He'll sign a new contract. Yeah, nothing nothing major going on there. Yeah, there you go. He signed a new contract. Knew that was going to happen. Robbie Musto. See, his contract's up in 02 as well. I might put him on my shortlist because, you know, his, his contract is up in 02. <clears throat> they keep coming for Gordon, and I really, really do not want him to go. I actually really like Gordon. I think he's definitely one for the future. And we could. I mean, I'm just looking at Hughes here. Oh, he's, he's a good player, Hughes. I can't not play Hughes. Yeah, well, I'm going to I'm gonna have to keep him on. It's it's difficult because you, you want to play all these players. I want to play Gordon at left-back. 
but then I also want to play Tommy as well somewhere so it's about fitting everybody in to the team but Hughes is just an absolute tank his influence is 20 right Hills is back actually oh, Strachan's back as well that's good news so that means John O'Kane can go back on the bench um, who did we put on I think we take Richardson off there Hills I mean yeah he's quicker isn't he He's quicker, yeah. And you've got to have Reed. I think we've got to have the experienced centre backs playing in Reed and Hughes. <clears throat> there we go. Richie Wellens again. No wonder there's so much interest in him. Uh, Coventry keep coming back in for him as well, which is. It's a bit annoying because it might disrupt him, you know, depending on how well they finish in Division 1. Uh, but if we get promoted, then I don't see a reason why he'd want to go to Coventry. That's a red card to want to... Oh, God. Right. It's going to have to be all Maraud, isn't it? Oh, my God. They've got to equalise as well. So frustrating sometimes, this game. It's never an easy game when you're this low down the league. But it's the fact that it's the FA Cup which is the most annoying thing. Because you're trying to get a bit of money there. You go, oh, I don't believe this. Don't believe it. Get the woodwork as well just then. Just for good measure to really piss me off. Yeah, we're not going to get anything here. That's just disappointing. He's got a hat trick, he has. 21. Ooh, he's not bad, actually. That, that's ridiculous, though. That was a poor result. Really poor. And that was down to him. That was down to Duff. The game changed the minute he went off. Uh, Van's trophy. I might have a little mess around here with um, with exact. Look at this. This is shit. We've lost both of these home games, man, since the beginning of this video. This isn't good enough. Better beat Southport, I'm telling you right now. Let's get him a new contract. Here we go, another bid. Should we just be really cheeky and ask for 3.5? I wonder who Carlisle got as well in the next round of the FA Cup. I'm going to have a look at that in a minute. Yeah, they give up on him. That's fair enough. Right, who have they got? Charlton away. Yeah, it's actually pretty shit. Right, who's that? Richie's knackered. Where is he? Let's get Clarkson in. Madeira is tired. Fenton in. Uh, Richardson instead of Ormerod as well. Uh, who else have we got here? Reed is tired. So, yeah, we'll get Tommy in. I'm thinking left, we'll put Gordon, we'll give him a game. Got McLeod as well, let's take him off. I mean, it really is. There's, there's only a few experienced players in this team, but it really should be enough to beat Southport at home. I'd be very surprised if we didn't. There we go, 1 0 Hughes. It's about time he had a good game. I haven't been impressed with him at all. The past couple of games he's really annoyed me. Two thousand and five that's not even bad for that for that, you know, it's still a decent bit. There you go, Richardson's with his goal, lovely. <clears throat> that's his first goal for us as well. Right, let's have a little look and just see if there's any Yeah, Clarkson needs to come off. Just Strachan needs to come now. I'm going to just take Clarkson off and put him there. Um, Madeira, no. Brett Ormer, no. No, we'll, we'll leave it. We'll leave the rest as they are. We'll give Because I want to give them a good run out. 
Okay, there we go. 2-0 win. Uh, let's just have a quick look and see the draw for the next round just before I finish this video. Um, draw all teams. Scunthorpe at home. It's a nut. Do you know what? We could actually win this, tro this trophy. This could be a really good opportunity for us to get some silverware in this season. Look at these guys. These these are nothing special. I mean, I know this is the northern draw. So you've got like southern teams as well over there. But that is a really good opportunity for us now. So second round, yeah. I think it's a great opportunity. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there for you. I'm going to have a quick um, turn around, clear the squad, because obviously we changed a load of stuff around. Please, man, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you for the next video.